Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, thank you, Ivan. Uh, first of all, I wish to thank organizers for giving me an opportunity to uh, say about Biopro, Biopol uh, project. The uh, structure of uh, uh, final polymers we are going to uh, prepare and to introduce to a specific uh, applications are shown here, pre-lactide, everybody knows. And uh, the second is aliphatic aromatic uh, polyester able to uh, biodegradation. Here are uh, shown some formal data for this uh, project. <laughs> I think that the, 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 the most important facts shown here is uh, budget is 10 approximately because of the changing rate <laughs> of euro towards Polish Zloty is uh, approximately 10 million, million euro uh, and uh, European Union uh, covers 85% Polish government 15%. And the realization period is four years for the January the 1st, 2010 till uh, end of 2013. That's, we are, let's say, in a one part of this uh, realization period of the project. Uh, the specific objectives of the project uh, are related to elaboration of uh, technologies for polylactide production in the model research installation called later on the, as a PLA installation. The same for this aliphatic aromatic polyester. And then various combination of PLA, aliphatic aromatic <coughs> polyesters, and blends of these polymers and their copolymers. Then of course important point is processing of uh, such homopolymers of or their blends and copolymers and the pro, uh, projects or uh, certain uh, industrial goods items, I mean final application of these uh, polymers. Uh, the project is realized by a not very big consortium composed of um, free institution, namely our Center of Molecular and Macromolecular Studies in Łódź, of Polish Academy of Sciences, of Warsaw Technical University, and Institute of Biopolymers and Chemical Fibers in Łódź. This is a former industrial research institute. Uh, from our uh, side are involved four laboratories namely Department of Polymer Chemistry, Polymer Physics, uh, Polymeric Materials Engineering, and Laboratory of Polymer Structures uh, at the Warsaw University of Technology are uh, in working two departments, namely Department of Polymer Chemistry and Technology and Laboratory of Technological uh, Processes. Uh, According to the specific goals, here are shown the, 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 the work <coughs> packages, including also literature, literature search and management and administration. This is what can be interesting for you is staff, scientific staff, PhDs, uh, 54 people, PhD students, eight people, master of science students, 14 people, technical staff, 24, administration 34. Of course, not everybody worked on a full position, only on a part of position, excluding PhD students, students which are fully covered from, <coughs> from, 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 from the project. Uh, the project manager is Professor Dr. Stanislaw Slomkowski, who was not able to come today. Uh, if I am how to say, plenty potentiary to the, to, the, to the project manager. And the scientific advisor to the project is Professor Stanislav uh, Penczek. Uh, by a chance, P 
because it was not intentional. Uh, we are uh, kind of supper consortium has been created in Poland because, for example, our center contributes to four European Union supported uh, projects. Biomassa presented today, Biopol, I, I am speaking now. <coughs> Biogratex will be presented tomorrow and Margen presented today uh, uh, too. Uh, concerning uh, synthetic pathways to uh, aliphatic polyesters, who are perhaps the most prominent members of the biodegradable polymers family, are based on polycondensation, ring opening polymerization, and uh, a few on uh, biotechnological means leading di directly to the, to the polymers. Uh, Specialty of my laboratory is uh, ring opening uh, polymerization and this is, I can say, a mature field because uh, methods of living and controlled polymerization uh, of uh, 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 cyclic esters leading to, 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 to aliphatic uh, linear um, polymers have been elaborated and uh, the best understood systems are polymerization of lactides, perhaps glycolide. However, it is not easy because of, of unsolubility of glycolide in majority of solvents, epsilon caprolactone, and, and other, other shown here uh, polymers. Uh, concerning catalytic and initiating system, almost every week in last decade, uh, new uh, catalyst or initiator has been proposed in the, in the uh, literature. However, only few have found a practical application in, the, uh, in this kind of uh, uh, synthesis. And perhaps the, the, the most often used is tin octoate, despite the, the tin is not maybe, it's not allowed in, 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 in the European countries, but, but is accepted by, by, by food uh, uh, and drug administration in in USA, and we spent some time in elaborating study, uh, studying mechanisms of this polymerization, and it appeared eventually that tinoctoate needs a co-initiator to start the polymerization, and this is a typical situation, I think, now in this kind of uh, synthesis. Uh, something disappeared, unfortunately, but it's not a big problem. We're able, using uh, tin uh, to um, alkoxide, to prepare in a controlled way polylactide in very uh, wide range of molar masses from even hundreds, practically, to one, one million. Then, uh, during realization of this project, we uh, focused on uh, looking for new initiators, and we concentrated on, uh, on metal-free initiating system because aim of our of this project is uh, concerning uh, uh, application of polylactide is biomedical field, and therefore we think that that that, that uh, perhaps this metal-free system are um, the best and uh, in the patent which is pending now, we propose the application of new uh, catalysts. This is bis to the method to funnel uh, emit, which uh, starts, initiates so-called activated uh, monomer polymerization. This means that the process in which active species is not located on the growing end chain, but on the monomer as you see on this, on this picture. And uh, using these cationic initiators, we observed that in, for example, copolymerization of lactide and beta-butyrolactone mixed together, uh, first the uh, 
polymerization of beta butylactone -beta proceeds, and then on this uh, poly beta butylactone -beta block, <coughs> on the poly polyhydroxyalkanoid block, is built the block of polylactide. I think this is one of a very f only few cases in the literature that the block copolymer is obtained directly from the mixture of two commonomers in one batch. And I think that, for example, this, this kind of copolymer can be used as a kind of uh, compatibilizer uh, in, in blends of poly polybutyrolactone and polylactide.